Take a look what's going on. Uh, we did have some sunshine this morning. It was glorious, and we knew some clouds were going to roll back in here, but unfortunately, uh, it's become kind of clouded over. Hopefully, we can clear this out a little bit this afternoon and get more sunshine. We will definitely get that for tomorrow. Here's our clearing for tomorrow. That will be here uh, overnight tonight. You can see that cloudy sky over Port Washington and it's 32 degrees. The wind at least has died down and is staying light, less than 10 miles per hour for the rest of today. Wind chills still in the 20s across most of the area. There's one lone 19 uh, in Waukesha and 20 in Beaver Dam, especially now with the cloud cover, it feels even colder. So your weather headlines, craziness. How about that? We saw the sun today. Spring fever is in the air. As you just heard, our own Bridget Shanahan wants it to be 70s every day. I do. <laughs> I know, I know. <laughs> uh, more wind is on the way, and it's going to be so mild this weekend that the showers will be in the form of rain. So while the winds are light right now, later tonight they start to pick up out of the southwest 20 to 25 miles per hour. They get gusty once again tomorrow during the day, anywhere from 25 to 35 miles per hour. And then tomorrow night could even see some gusts approaching 40 miles per hour. Notice the direction, though, out of the southwest, a warm direction, especially when states to our south are going to be enjoying 70s this weekend. So here's how it shapes up. This afternoon we'll stay in the mid 30s with that partly to mostly cloudy sky. Tonight we'll stay in the lower 30s and then a rapid warm up tomorrow. Look at the low to mid 50s around the area. It's going to be nice, especially with the sunshine. The wind, however, we can do without, but we can deal with it. at least they're not going to have wind chills of 20 below, which we could easily do this time of the year. On the Goddard gauge, we'll give it a seven. An average day, partly to mostly cloudy now, 37 degrees and less wind for a few more hours. Then the winds begin to kick up as the next storm system approaches to the west. Tomorrow is quiet weather wise, except for the wind. It'll be sunny with temperatures in the 50s, as I showed you. But then here comes the next storm system off to the west. We'll see that front start to move in here in the afternoon. The morning hours are sunny and windy and warm, mid 50s once again. And then the front moves in in the evening hours. And that's when we see our best chance for some rain for today. Excuse me, I'm choked up. Partly cloudy and 37. A nice day. Southwest winds at 10 to 15 tonight. We'll gradually see clearing. And that bright moon returns. If you were out and about last night, boy, there were shadows. It was so bright. And a southwest wind starts to increase at 10 to 20. Here's how it shapes up on the seven day forecast. Get ready for the roller coaster ride. 54 tomorrow, plenty of sunshine and a lot of wind. More clouds as the day wears on on Sunday. Better chance of rain in the afternoon and a high of 55 degrees. Windy and 44. Oh, yeah, by the way, get used to the wind. It's going to be with us pretty much all of next week. We're watching a storm system for Tuesday evening into Wednesday. We may have to shovel. And then Tuesday, getting colder back into the 20s. Those aren't 70s. That's not my fault. <laughs> yeah, all right. Well, the weekend looks okay, Brian. Right.